members of the council, my name is Burton Wiest, and I'm losing my voice, I apologize. Um, which is probably good for you. Uh, I also uh, served on the uh, incentives committee, and I agree with Dan Wright that uh, w the committee favored using the matrix process that you find and the set aside of 25% uh, that was given to you in the report. Uh, I would suggest to the council and the community that exit 118 represents much uh, represents the next 20 years of economic development in this community. It is a, an event much like when the major casinos were built, when our great golf courses were built, that developed what Mesquite is about. And as Dan mentioned, what happens if you go on the auction process? Then the highest bidder will get the land and your only control is zoning. And the zoning, rightfully so, is very broad. Uh, in these types of areas for industrial and commercial zoning. Uh, and a person could very well buy this property at auction simply to sit on it and see what other development occurs in the area and then sell it later and, in other words, speculate on the property. Uh, normally, I wouldn't be before you saying the city shouldn't be involved in a private venture. But this is the one time where the city will set the tone for what happens in the next decade and perhaps the next 20 years in the industrial park and on 118. And if there ever was a time for the city to use the objective uh, uh, process that we laid out in our report, the incentive matrix, if ever there was a time for the city to do it, this is it. Uh, because it will allow the city to work with a developer, it will allow the community to have input on what development goes out there. I think you've already heard lots of people saying, uh, or you've already heard about what happened when we tried to have a truck center uh, located on exit 122. Uh, the community cares about what happens on exit 118. And the best way to keep that community involvement and frankly do the right thing for this community for the next 20 years is to use the incentives process. Uh, and I appreciate the council's consideration of my remarks. Thank you.